It was on October 25, 2022, that the results of another review on the Lego Ideas platform were announced. Of the four chosen projects, only one had not yet been made official, and it was one that generated the most expectations, and rightly so. Set 21345 LEGO Ideas Polaroid One Step becomes the 51st set of the, in the LEGO Ideas theme and for me is one of the best in this type of model, after the grand piano and typewriter, being much more affordable, although not exactly cheap. The model has 516 pieces and it will cost 8 euros, equivalent to 15.5 cents per part, a really high value, especially considering that the set mentioned above costs 11 and 12 cents per part. It will be available for sale on January 1st, 2024, and you can pre-book it now. Regarding the fan original idea, Mark Mini Brick Productions, two big differences stand out, and for me for the better. The mechanism that ejects the photograph ceased to exist and was replaced by a true shooting system, where a photograph is expelled from the camera after pressing the shooter. This button contains a print, in order to keep the appearance of the machine as real as possible, with a 2x2 round tile with a red top instead of using an identical, identical piece but all red. The central stripes also went from stickers to normal elements, in fact the set has very few stickers, just 4. On the side of a round element, where it would be difficult to print, a tile with a name, Polaroid Land Camera, and the serial numbers, one step, for the American version, or 1000, European version, you can choose one for display on your model. Another difference, because of the change in the injection system, is related to the photo elements. They are no longer printed tiles and became paper elements. Not only are more similar to the real ones, but it's easier for the system to work. And the set features three photos, one with the founder, Edwin Land, another one with the Lego house, and one with Mark's sister, the fan who created the original idea, with La Rochelle as background, the place where they spent their holidays and which served as an inspiration for the model. Comparing it with the real model, I borrowed a very similar one, the Polaroid 1000 Supercolor. This has some differences in relation to the One Step 1000, such as the lens, but in terms of appearance and dimensions it is very similar, and in fact, the LEGO version managed to perfectly recreate the features of the real model, both in terms of color scheme and design, where even the dimensions are perfectly the same. The LEGO Polaroid XS70 measures 9 by 9 by 15 width, height, depth, in centimeters. I love the construction process, relatively quick and not at all complex, and the shooting system really works very very well, as you can see in the video. In the next days I will upload an article about this set with questions made to the design team. So are there any fans of the Polaroid? What is your opinion about this set? Stay tuned for more set reviews from other themes in the next days from City, Ninjago, France and something else. Thank you LEGO for sending the set for review. Opinions on it are my sole responsibility. And don't forget, play well.